You already know what it is. It's that flat top checking in, baby. Hey, I was looking at these people have altercation at the gas station, right? You these two guys, you know. You know, they was just all have a little altercation. And uh, it got into a fight, though. It got into a fight, right? And when it got into a fight, this is what happened. What happened was, you know what I'm saying, I guess the man beat the dude to the gas pump or whatever. And the man beat the dude to the gas pump and he tried to pull up. He was like, hey, that's my spot or whatever. So they got to argue. They got to argue. One boy, he was like, you know, you know, he was like, had like a little thug mentality. And the other guy, he had like, you know, he a blue collar type. You know what I mean? Had on a suit. The other dude had his pants hanging off his ass and all that. So he started messing with the dude with, you know what I'm saying, the blue collar. And the blue collar, man, the blue collar picked something up over there by the ground and cleaned this clock. And when he cleaned this clock, I think it was like a little small rock or a brick or something. But he picked something up. It was an object. And he clocked his ass. And he clocked his ass and dude like, dude, it's not a fair fight. First of all, ain't no such thing as no fair fight. You can't dictate how a person feel when you bother them. At the end of the day, if you go over there bothering that person, you don't know what they've been through, you don't know what they're tired of, you don't know what they had enough of, you don't know what they're sick of. And at the end of the day, they probably done had it with something. And then he, you taking your ass over there and want to bother them or you want to have an altercation and want to get snappy with them. Like some people snap and they just go off the chain, just go from one to a thousand. And you be like, damn, it wasn't even that serious. What they pissed off about? Stop fooling with people. Stay in your lane. Ain't no such thing as a fair fight. Some people like to shoot. Some people like to stab. At the end of the day, you don't know what that person been doing their whole life. You don't know what they've been thinking about their whole life. You don't know how they was raised. You don't know where they come from. You don't know what they done been through, like I said. And then you want to bother people and then have a the nerve to call a fair fight. Whatever you do to the next person, and however they take your ass or however they approach you, that's on you. Because you don't know what they done been through. And at the end of the day, people have problems. People have issues. And people, they can do stuff. And then like when, when they go off, when, they, when people go off the chain, it's like a trigger. And what I mean by a trigger, they already done been through enough shit. All they need is that one more thing to snap. And here your ass go. And then when they get the wild and out on you, and then you're going to want to call the police and say, get them off me or whatever. Or get her off me or whatever. And then you're like, what's wrong with them? They crazy. They trying to, they trying to kill me. You remember them old school fights? You know, when the old lady come outside, don't kill him. You know, something like that. At the end of the day, you don't know what that person has been through. And they're sick of it. Now they're ready to tear your ass up. Ain't no such thing as a fat fight. So the best thing that you need to do is stay in your lane and shut the hell up and mind your business. Don't agitate people. You don't know what kind of day people have had. You don't know where they came from. You don't know what they're about. You got to be careful out here. There's some crazy people out here. Mental health is serious. So before you go start poking a bear, you don't know if it's a bear, you don't know if it's an alligator, you don't know if it's a mosquito. It's very, you know how when you, hey, you know how when you play a video game and you got that little black spot and you you got that little, you know, the little random spot where you just push a button and you don't know what you're going to get? That's exactly how you deal with people these days. You know what you, you don't know what you're going to get. Stay in your lane and mind your business.